there's 65. the red, but he's not on the colour. Not well, anyway. He really needs to just... He's, he's flying at the moment. Just keep that positive thinking. Just get down and pot the blue. He's obviously thinking about possibly putting a colour safe, but... I think the way you're playing, you've not missed a ball in the last two frames, virtually. I could not refuse this blue, Clive. But he's gonna. He puts the black side. Oh, Wilson, 65. The difference is 65. In theory, this 67 still on, but not with the black there. So, so. One. Wow. Well, oh, what a shot this is. Okay, he's hampered by this red. On, yeah, will Kai and Wilson regret not taking the blue on. Eight. What a clearance this would be. You'd have to say the way he's played the last black. three frames, he's not favourite. He's got an angle in the black to take this red off the cushion now. Sixteen. Forty-nine behind, fifty-one on. He's not got many points to play with here. Sure Seventeen. Managed to find position on the pink in the middle. If he has, that's an incredible shot. The clearance is still on. So two reds, two blacks needed to pinch this frame by one point. Well, I don't think he's going to clear up now. Because even if he pots the black, I can't see any way of getting on the last red. I'm raising the button, the queue. This makes this pot so difficult. Mr. Barry, he continues to play immediately. So, Karen Wilson has won four frames in succession and now leads by nine frames to eight. One up with two to play. So, since the, the black along the cushion, this is the first miss missable pot he's had. He's missed a couple of blacks this week, mm. playing with a touch of right-hand side. If he's going to use a bit of side here, he'll be putting his full attention into this. Yeah, safely in. I think because of those two misses, he didn't play it with a lot of... Well, a little bit tentative. You can understand it at this situation of this match. Closer and closer to the winning line. Staring down the potting point on this red. Oh, 
Robinson, 61. One last chance for O'Sullivan. One. Well, Ronnie could have done with another inch or two with the cue ball. To make the black unmissable, he's got to go into the bunch. It's missable now. And he's on a red to right middle. Yeah, that red Eight. has gone close to the right middle pocket. It's not possible there. So he's got a chance to get right back into this frame. Just a little stun here for the pink to the opposite middle. Nine. Well, like in the previous frame, Karen Wilson's got to sit there and suffer. Pray that Rune Sullivan doesn't make a winning clearance here. Fifteen. Sixteen. Unlike the previous frame, 22. The clearance. Well, he's got a lot more points to play with in this break. So get on this last red. And position on the pink to just nudge that red over the middle pocket. 29. He's just going to be careful he doesn't. It not, just knock this red into the middle pocket here. Cushion first is not guaranteed to leave himself a pot. He shaved past the cannon. 36. Well, I don't believe he tried to cross double that. He's actually got away with it. Okay. Surely he's not snooking on behind the pink. Ronnie O'Sullivan, 36. Can't believe the shot I've just seen Ronnie play. In the frustration, I think. <laughs> Very unlike O'Sullivan to give way to frustration like that, as he's been recently, at least. He used to do it in the old days when he was quite a bit younger. I mean, that cue ball in red just could have finished anywhere. Karen could have been left a straight red into this left middle pocket. Now he's faced with, when well, the problem is not hitting the red, the problem is keeping it safe. If O'Sullivan clears up here, he can thank his lucky stars that he left the last red safe from his ill-considered last shot. One. No, not the best cue ball. Sure, the yellow doesn't pass the brown into its own pocket, so I have to play for it into one of the middle pockets. I think. Don't think it passes a green either. This needs to be struck well. Oh, and did he strike it well? Did he strike that well? <laughs> it's the best shot he's played for about five or six frames. That seven. Nine. Twelve. 
16. What a steal this would be. Twenty one. Well, we've said one of Karen Wilson's strengths is his temperament. Oh, boy, it's been tested now for this deciding frame. 61, but over top of red. And in two visits, separated by an outrageous stroke of luck. And Sullivan has cleared up to level the match at 9 all. Johnny O'Sullivan trying to get his name on that trophy for the third time. Callum Wilson for his first. It's 9 all. It's all on the 19th frame. Thank you. The deciding frame. Ronnie O'Sullivan to break. Still, O'Sullivan rose to the challenge. He still had to pop the balls. Yeah, it has to be said, pink to yellow. It was just a magnificent piece of queuing under pressure. Another magnificent piece of queuing required here. That was asking a lot. So Wilson is first in. I think he's got to play the shot. Played it to perfection. Oh. I can't believe that. Kara Wilson one, Ronnie O'Sullivan seven. It looks like he's not destined to win this match, Clive. Well, that was certainly a body blow, as was the last frame. Well, he's missed us by a mile. For a horrible second, the rope was going to hit the black and go in the corner pocket. Well, a chance for O'Sullivan. I think the two or three things that have happened to Karen Wilson in the last ten minutes or so. I've knocked the stuffing out of him. One. Foul. Oh, waistcoat foul, would you believe it? Ronnie O'Sullivan, one. Byron Wilson, five. Well, what's going to happen next <laughs> in this final? That's so careless. I mean, he looked, he looked to see where his waistcoat was and then he still got down and fouled it. Oh. Oh. Karen Wilson's turn to play a speculative double. Got the double kiss on the red. He's left a pot to left middle. One. Quite a nasty shot, this, from the middle pocket jaw. He 
secured that well. That'll actually make him feel a bit better, that shot. Six. Seven. Choices here, how hard he wants to hit this. 13. Screwing the cue ball out, I think. Now, is he going to land nicely on the colour? Well, the answer is absolutely 14. yes. Is that the shot that's going to lead to victory for Ronnie O'Sullivan? When Wilson was on 61 in the last frame, he must have thought he was going to lose in the next couple of minutes. 19. But he managed to win the frame, and now he's got the advantage in the decider. Well, he played a poor shot in the blue, though. This is missable. That's safely in. 20. You visibly see how hard Ryan Sullivan's trying here, putting everything into these shots. he's found this victory from but it looks ever more certain that he's going to find 25. it he's been hugely helped of course by well, Karen missing that red on 61 26. in the previous frame and also a couple of massive slices of good fortune Karen Wilson was in first in this frame played the correct shot into the bunch I was horrified to see a red go in the middle but the way the reds are placed, you can't see a mistake. Thirty-four. Forty. Forty-one. Watching Kyle Wilson in his chair and he looks devastated. After such a great effort, Going from a big deficit to the brink of victory. Forty-seven. Oh. You have to say, when his run of the balls has been horrific. But forty-eight. You've got to give some credit to this man. He had to do the clearance in the last frame. Fifty-three. What an incredible match. The 5 1 to O'Sullivan, it looked like a runaway. 59. At 8 5, he was comfortably ahead. 60. But at 9 8, and was rescued at least in part. 67. By an outrageously kind run of the ball when he rashly attempted the cross double on the last red. Commiserations to Wilson, who so unluckily knocked the red into the middle pocket as he opened the bunch. Finish with a century. 83. 85. 88. It will be O'Sullivan's 11th century of the tournament. 92. Ninety-seven. 
severities. 103. As Sullivan finishes in style of the century. The clearance of 110. He beats Karen Wilson by 10 frames to 9 in the most dramatic of matches. He was almost out of it, but somehow he survived and he's gone on to become champion of champion for the third time. But we enjoy as much as anything a drama and we saw that tonight and that penultimate frame you must have thought that the, the, the tournament was away glad you enjoyed it because i didn't <laughs> um, i was lucky today he should have won that really uh, that double day i got away with it ladies and gentlemen our champion of champion ronnie o'sullivan <laughs>